Okay, so it's day two of Genrethon, and I didn't film an update yesterday because I was coming home from my spring break. I had to drive like five hours, and so I didn't really read much. I was listening to Harry Potter on audio, so maybe that can count towards my reading. I don't know, it's fantasy, that's a genre. And then when I got home, I had to try to finish this book called Dream House that I needed to read for review, and... That's done and over with, moving on. Anyway, you can watch that review if you want. But yeah, now I'm reading The Merciless and I'm on about page, I think like 20 or something. Um, I like it so far and that's a horror book. So yeah, I hope you guys are doing well if you're participating in Genrethon. Hopefully I will have more updates soon about my reading. Hey guys, so it is... <laughs> Um, so it is day uh, three, technically, I think day four, because it's 12.30 of Genrethon. Um, oh, I'm really recording something. You're going to be in it. Hey, so, I thought this was Snapchat. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'll just put on my hand sanitizer. <laughs> um, I didn't really read anything today. I listened to Harry Potter in, on audio in my car, but I don't know if that counts. Um, and also I have this zit on my lip, so I'm really winning at Genrethon, but Whitney's putting on her hand sanitizer, so. Actually, she, there she goes. Gotta make sure that 99.9% of germs are out of here. Right, ladies? <laughs> Am I right, ladies? All right, I'll check in tomorrow. Bye. Hello, it is day four of Genrethon. I have not read anything from my TBR today. I'm actually technically studying for an exam. Um, communication or as an ethical response on behalf of an organization. On if you thought that sounded boring, you'd be correct. It is boring. Um, I did listen to more Harry Potter on audio in, in my car today, and then I also listened to the fifth Lux book on audio while I was at work, because I'm just basically only listening to audiobooks, I guess. I don't know. I haven't been prioritizing reading. I'm sorry, and now I'm studying for an exam. I don't know. Also, this lighting is horrendous. I don't know why I chose to do this. Well, anyway, hope your reading is going well. Have a nice day. Okay, I gotta go. So it's day five of the readathon, and I am on page 50 of The Merciless. I read a little bit of it today. I don't know. I had an exam today and an appointment, and I listened to Harry Potter on audio some more. I'm almost done with the Chamber of Secrets, so I'm just gonna count that in this readathon. And yeah, basically that's it. And then I went to Walmart and I bought a lot of makeup, like so much makeup. And then I hung out with a friend, but I guess I'll show you my makeup. Makeup haul. Literally so much makeup. I don't know what shade I am. I just want to try all the foundation. I don't know. So much, And I just want my face to be highlighted. That's all I want in life. And then like that. And then I also got um, brushes. I don't know what I'm doing. I just have to try everything. Okay guys. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I have a zit on my lip that is really inconvenient. Let's not talk about that. And I keep forgetting that other people's readathons don't go eight days. So I keep being like, yeah, I still have Sunday to read as well as Saturday. That's not true. Also, I have a paper due on Monday. I need to do that because last time, I don't know if anybody follows my Snapchat story, but last month I had a paper that was 10 pages and I didn't remember till the day before. It was bad. It was real bad. I gotta make sure to do that. But anyway, hope your Jonathan is going well. So it is day six of the readathon and I'm almost done listening to Harry Potter on audio and I listened to like an hour of Scarlet on audio. I don't know if I'm gonna read more tonight. It's around 10 p.m. but I'm doing some homework right now and I have to watch a movie because I have to write a paper about it and all this stuff. Also, I want to take this moment to make a movie recommendation because I'm writing it on one of my favorite movies of all time. It's called Timer. It's so good. It's random. I found it on Netflix like, I don't know, like four years ago. And the girl who played Anya, 
from Buffy is the main character and it's about this world, or well, our world, where everyone wears these things on their wrists called timers and it counts down to the day that you're gonna meet your soulmate and then the main character, hers, hasn't started yet, meaning that her soulmate hasn't gotten a timer and then her sister's isn't gonna go off till she's like 43 so they have like really conflicting issues and it's just kind of about like figuring out love and like certainty about love and it's just a really good movie and I love it and I always recommend it to people and I'm really glad to be writing a paper about it because I know this movie so well. So it is day seven of Genrethon and I didn't really read anything today, but last night I read 36 pages of Grace and Style. It was good. And then I read total this week, I read 50 pages of The Merciless. And then I listened to a lot of Harry Potter. I actually am basically almost done listening to The Chamber of Secrets. But to be honest, I didn't really commit a lot to reading this week. This vlog is probably like, one of my worst. You all know I'm not good at readathon, so that's all I have to say pretty much about this week. Again, I hope you guys had a good time if you participated in Genrethon. Um, if you didn't, I would say you should subscribe to Joss from Scoble Reads and all the other girls who lead this readathon so that next time you can join in because it was super fun. Hope you enjoyed watching this boring vlog. You're all beautiful. Have a nice day.